lovely people out there, welcome to Tales of Nana Abba. This week on my journey, I am breaking every limitation of my mind. I am working on my mind and I want you to be part of this journey because I believe that I am as good as my mindset. Whatever my mind says I am is who I am. I can never rise above what my mind tells me I am. And so let's take this journey and before I can break any limitation of my mind I must first of all begin to identify that which limits me and for me it's always been the fear of making mistakes or the thoughts that keeps coming into my mind that I am not good enough for anything and it became so bad for me that I never wanted to be out there. I love to be in my comfort zone all the time. I always wanted to be just at the back. If it's about singing, I wouldn't want to take the mic and lead. I always wanted to always just be a backer, okay? I just want to back all the time because it was comfortable. Nobody's going to judge you. Nobody's going to see anything wrong about it. And so it was comfortable to do that. And so even when I am good at something and someone tells me I am good, it became so bad that immediately you tell me I am good at it. It feels like an insult because my mind had already accepted that I wasn't good for that. And so when someone sees something good about me and is saying it, I always felt it wasn't true. And I felt so embarrassed when someone tells me I'm good at something. And that is how bad it came, it became for me. And so, and then the other thing was um, the fear of making mistakes. Hey, what if I take this step and it doesn't go well? Oh my God, I cannot face the embarrassment that will come. In fact, I would die now. So I just definitely wouldn't take any step because if I, if I, don't succeed in it I might not be able to overcome the embarrassment that comes with it and so these two things destroyed me it took so much from me so much opportunities that I could have um, so much opportunities that I could have had in my youth age youthful age or young age I it robbed me of all of it because I was comfortable at where I wasn't supposed to be. And so if I'm taking these steps now, I kind of feel that somebody out there who is young can rise above what you think, who you think you are and take certain steps in your life because you can be better than where you are. All right, if you're a young person watching me, I want you to be courageous and know that whatever mistakes you are afraid to take if you wait till you are old those mistakes you are going to make but you are definitely going to get better if I had someone telling me this when I was growing up I, I probably would have um, overcome certain mindsets I, I grew up with and so please I need you to believe in yourself a little more because if you believe you sure can and you will and so this this journey we are going to work on our mind delete all the negative thoughts that keep bringing in our minds we are deleting all those negative thoughts and we are replacing them with the positive things we want to see for ourselves and so this week anything I'm going to feed my mind on I, I, I am going to share with you and so that includes the things I watch the things I'll hear listen to the things that I am going to say it includes having the right kind of confession declarations affirmation and I'm also going to share with you people's stories that they were able to overcome certain fears in their lives certain limitations in their lives so please I am welcoming you let's do this together if you if you are out there and you feel limited by any means if there is something you know you have to start doing now please don't wait if there is any step you need to take take it now 
you might not have tomorrow. Today is just the right time to take that step. Don't be afraid to make mistakes because in your mistake, you will surely get better. And when you get better, you can make better impacts. And so please, join me on this journey. And so, as I begin to share with you people's stories and all that, I sure will share with you songs as well. Because whatever we feed our mind into is what is going to help us to have the right kind of mindset. And so it's important that we are intentional with the kind of things that we feed our mind on this week. And so please, let's listen to the right music. Let's listen to the right people. Those negative people in your life, you must begin to identify them and begin to stay apart from them because you might think you are ignoring them, but your subconscious mind might be taking so much from what they say. So be intentional with the people you want to hear from this week so that you will be able to achieve this important goal with me. Yes, and so before I, I close, I am dedicating a song especially for anyone who wants to take a step and is struggling to do that for the fear of making mistakes or for the fear of not being good enough for the thoughts that rise into your mind i want to dare you this 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 week that you can if you believe and so the song that i'm going to play after this I want you to critically learn the song because God gave me the song especially for you. I wrote this song especially for somebody watching me right now. And so please don't miss out on that song. Let it be, I dedicate it to you and I want you to have it over and over and over and over until your mind begin to accept the words of the song. May the Lord empower you and inspire you throughout this week to take this journey with me. Join me on my Facebook uh, and Instagram as I share my goals along with you this week. And then join me next week on my YouTube channel as we take our next journey. May the Lord help us all to overcome this journey, to be able to overcome and be better this week. God bless you. I love you all. Bye. Don't give it up